Thank you, Squarespace, for sponsoring this video. Whether you're looking for a website, blog, or an online store, make sure to check out Squarespace. Use the coupon code MANNY. You get 10% off. What's going on, everybody? I just landed in New York for Photo Plus. So where is my limo driver? Oh, there it is right there. You gonna give me a ride? Are you Manny Ortiz? Yeah, I am. Oh, nice to meet you. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I've been waiting for hours. Let's go. <laughs> Waking up, feeling the taste of our fight last night. What's going on everybody? This is Manny Ortiz and this is the first time that I held a Sony a7R 3 in my hands. I really liked what I saw. The autofocus was super, super snappy. That's probably the first thing I noticed. But to be honest, there's only so much that you can learn from this camera on the trade show floor. I needed to take it out into the real world. So thanks to Sony, they set up a really cool portrait event for us ambassadors to use this camera in the real world. So let's head over there right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, why always me? Ooh, oh, like I'm Ooh, oh, why always me? Ooh, oh, like I'm Balu Telly, Telly, Telly. Yeah, why always me? Ooh, oh, like I'm Balu Telly. Ooh, oh, why don't you see? Ooh, oh, trying to call you Telly. People act like they know me But you don't really know me I've been out here on my own I've been out, I've been grinding all alone Yeah, Get up at night, we can pour out the wine I got cash on my mind, yeah I don't really mind And I don't have the time What's going on everyone, Manny and Diana here and we're giving our first impressions of the Sony a7R 3 and five reasons why I'm upgrading. Sorry babe, it costs $3,200 but... It's okay, I'm right. getting new makeup out of it. Uh, yes I am, continue. Sure. The a7R 3 was announced, I was hoping that they didn't raise the megapixel count on it. Like if this camera had over 50 megapixels I probably wouldn't buy it because it's just a waste of megapixels. I don't need that many megapixels for my kind of work. And 42 megapixels provides enough resolution. Like I can see everything when I edit. I mean, you can attest to that, right? Yeah. That's why I don't like picking out the images you want. Why is that? To. Because you can see into my soul. I know what I'm going to look like in 10 years because of those pictures. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty. <laughs> and what they did was optimize all the pieces around the sensor uh, just to make it perform better and I was super happy that they did that. One of the best things that Sony did to this camera was improve the battery life. Now here's the A7R2 battery, here is the A9 battery. We have to hide behind it because it's going to use facial recognition. So these are the two batteries. The Z battery is not that much bigger but it makes such a big impact in the battery life. Remember that wedding we shot at the Willis Tower? The wedding you shot at the Willis Tower. Well yeah, we didn't shoot, but yeah, you were a guest. I shot that entire wedding with the A9 on one single battery. And that, was, and that was around 2,000 shots that I did that night. And with the A7 or two batteries, I'd probably have to go through three of these. So it makes a big difference. It's just a hassle always carrying these batteries and always having to charge them around the house. It's a pain in the butt. It is. First of all, <laughs> he unplugs my coffee maker. He unplugs my alarm clock. He unplugs my Glade scented plugins. All he unplugs the, all the glades, everything. For sure, the Glades. And that's, that's annoying from a wise perspective. It's no secret, battery life sucked on the A7R2. And although the battery life isn't a deal breaker, these batteries right here are an absolute game changer when it comes to using the Sony mirrorless system. The third reason why I'm definitely gonna be getting the A7R3 is for the buffer performance. Now, it isn't a secret that the buffer on the A7R2 was not great. Um, I would take 15 shots in a row and you would have to wait like 10 seconds for the buffer to clear out. Guys, 10 frames per second. Check this out. The A7R2, at, at this point, you would not be able to review the photos. With the A7R3, you are able to review the photos while it's buffering. And that makes me very happy. <laughs> A7R3, you could take 
20, 30 shots, and you can still review the images while the camera's buffering the shots. How, how cool is that? It is cool because then it's just everything flows better. You can show me my images. They look great. Bam, let's get back to work. Yep, awesome. exactly, exactly. The fourth reason why I'm getting the A7R 3 is the autofocus improvement that I noticed in the camera. Now, most of the shots were in low light, so that's a good thing. Better low light performance is always good. But one thing I definitely noticed was the eye autofocus. It reminded me of the Sony A9. And if you have never used A9, the eye autofocus is just crazy good. Like she could even close her eyes and it will still focus. It will still put a box over her eye. Um, and it really reminded me of that. And that's a great thing to have in this camera. I mean, it's so reliable. You don't have to recompose your shots anymore. You don't have to do this because it's gonna connect to that eye and you could hold your camera however you want. Babe, you know I love IAF. I always say that in all my videos. I love eye autofocus. So, thank you, Sony. The fifth reason is the joystick that's on the Sony a7R 3 The Sony a7R 2 lacked the joystick. That's one of the biggest, my, one of my biggest gripes about that body versus my old Canon 5D camera. I loved having the joystick to be able to move that little box around without having to press any extra buttons was, was really convenient and made the camera a lot more ergonomic. So on the a7R 2 to change focus points, it was a two button process. You needed to press the focus mode, then you needed to press enter, and then you could change your focus point. And yes, that was a huge letdown, especially when shooting a wedding and you needed to change your focus points fast. Just like the Sony A9, the Sony a7R 3 allows you to move the focus points with the joystick without pressing any extra buttons so you can quickly take a shot and recompose your next image. That's one of the biggest reasons why this camera is definitely going to be in my camera bag. I love having access to a joystick. Does it bring joy to your life? <laughs> Little things that are really handy about this camera is the dual SD card slots and that's something I'm not really excited too much about because I stopped shooting weddings but for my wedding photographers out there dual SD card slots this is what you've been wanting and what you've been waiting for and also another little thing is the ability to rate images now I really miss this off my old Canon and now I, I can rate images I can map it to a button a custom button on the camera and you can rate the photo that you want so when I come back in Lightroom, I already know which one you chose instead of coming, having to bring you back here and check the images, yeah, you know what I mean? Wait for it to upload and then seeing it on a big screen and yeah. seeing all your freaking vlogs. Yeah, and... so the Ray button is a huge welcome to this camera and I'm super excited about that as well. Alrighty, I hope you enjoyed the first impression video of the Sony A7R 3 I wanna give a huge shout out to this lovely lady over here for that amazing video work that she did for the behind the scenes clips. And what babe? We'll see you in the next, next video. video. <laughs> What's up everybody, Manny Ortiz here, and today we're talking about- And Diana. Five reasons why I'm getting it. How many? Five. Okay, that's what I meant. I think they saw. <laughs> five reasons. <laughs> five reasons. <laughs> Get over here, Rio, let's do, let's do this. <laughs> Tell me over okay. the way, be nice. Let's go. I'm gonna re refer you to your video. <laughs> Professional. To the you're, not, you're not a model right now. You're then why am I here? Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm the host, but okay. <laughs> Good. Battery, this is what the A9 had. That is... Stop uh, Excuse me. What? It's supposed to... I'm trying to block your face because, you know... Block it's... your face? No, because it's, it's focusing on your face. Because the camera knows what's up. It knows who the host is. Oh, no, right here. Are you ready? One, two, three. Okay, Arjana, hold a bunch of shots. And you couldn't review... The... You couldn't see the images because it kept saying loading. Stop saying remember. Don't worry about it. You said everything good. No. I'm done. You, you said everything good. Babe, let you me said remember, everything just good. Lower it. Oh my god. 